Hello guys, this is Great Yuki Summit here, and I got a new mic, so, um, you wanna tell me if this, um, is any better than it was? Or is? Just curious on what your thoughts are. If you think this mic does better, leave in a comment and, well, in the description, and, well, yeah, I'm gonna go take on the rest of the trainers out here. You know what, let's go do what I said I was gonna do. So... Okay, so you walk like this, and I'm the owner of the Seashore House. But you can call me Mr. C. What I love above all is to see hot Pokemon battles. Let me see that your heart burns hot. Heart burns hot. Is it talking about your heart burns hot? Or your heart burn you have? If you can defeat all the trainers here, I'll avoid your efforts. So we're gonna go with what, who I consider to be the easiest trainer of all. Um, let me see. Yeah, Mighty Pies up front. And I healed my Pokemon since then. I'll tell you exactly where I healed them when we go in that direction. So yeah. I'm going to show you how great my Pokemon are, but don't cry. Yeah, I might as well show something off since I didn't really get much done last part. Even though it was a 15 minute part, I could have gotten a lot done in that part. And you know what? What's magnitude? Oh! Oh! 10! 10! I've never seen a 10! At least in this game through, game playthrough. Ooh, Mighty Pie is actually becoming useful. Or, um, no, let's actually, let's keep you in Mighty Pie. Do the You know what? Let's try this. Rock to him. Take that, no. Uh. Hmm. Speed belt, though. Ah, I use water gun. That's actually going to be pretty effective. Though I don't know why it's pretty effective. I think it's effective against ground space, but it's not, like, super effective, so it doesn't do, like, a bunch of damage, but mm, still. And we take down this middle. And yeah, that Meryl didn't see it coming. Oh yeah, and, um, I don't know if I introduced myself, but it's, yeah, it's the game, Games of Yuki. I think I said the great Yuki, so I'm a, that was my old YouTube channel. But yeah, it's Games of Yuki here, and we are playing Pokemon Emerald. I don't know if I said that earlier, so I'm just trying to clarify and get this up. I'm playing battles. Aren't worth the effort. Fiery hot battles. I want thousands of trainers and Pokemon. I know that's a lady, but I made him sound like James. More feminine James. Beauty Jonah. We like to battle. Beauty Jonah sent out Goldeen. And I send out Magnitude. To do a shit ton of damage and destroy the Goldeen. Definitely needed. Mighty Pie needs to be level 17. I think Mighty Pie is my second strongest. Um, yes, actually, we are gonna let you learn big. And, uh, which one's more, no, no, Rock Tomb. I just want to get rid of that TM since no Pokemon uses it that's really useful after like level 10. So, yeah, Mighty Pie learned dig. Yeah, dig. Dig. What? Jonah only had one Pokemon? Oh, wow. If you're looking for it, wait, if you're looking for a battle in the seashore house, you'll find no harder trainer than me, matey. Sailor Dwayne, we like the battle. Sailor Dwayne, send out Wingo. You can even go sends out Mighty Pie. Mighty Pie used magnitude, but I forgot he was flying, so it doesn't actually hurt him. Mingle used supersonic. I'm gonna be fucked. Time to switch Pokemon out. Let's bring out Shinkachu, since he's my weakest Pokemon in levels. It's a pain in the ass to do this voice, because I got went to the dentist two days ago. But, Water Gun, let's go. I don't get how Water Gun is so powerful against the Wingle, but apparently it's very powerful against the Wingle. Pikachu, 
the metal attack. He is to watch again. And Wingle is defeated. It's not very effective. Both Wingle fainted. Mighty Pie gained 75 experience. And Shankachu gained 75 experience. Say what Dwayne is about to use my chomp. Well, I'm gonna not switch out. Say what Dwayne sent out the chomp. You know what? Shankachu uses water gun. And it was pretty powerful. Oh, don't low kick me. Take this water gun to the face. And that Machamp was destroyed by a critical hit. Shankachu gained, went to level 16. Same moon as Chatsu. Tentacruel. Let's actually switch out from Mighty Pie. Go, Mighty Pie. Sales Twain said that Tentacruel. cool. Mighty Pie used Dig. Tentacle use Poison Sting. Okay, so we're actually gonna get shit done this time. So I'm gonna talk to this guy. You're scorching hot, those battle plays. I'm more than just satisfied. Thanks for showing me your hot streak. I want you to take these. That's a half dozen bottles of soda. Yay, I got six sodas. Um, actually, I'll buy one. So, yeah, I know we're already six minutes in this video, and it's pretty boring watching me do all these Pokemon battles. So, um, we are... I'm going to take on the rest of the people in... on the beach, and see you... After I'm done. Apparently I only missed one trainer. That was a waste of time. Beep! Roxanne. Hmm. Oh, hello, Yuki. This is Roxanne of Respiro. I heard from Brawly that you're moving up to the ranks of trainers. An incredible clip. Well, I'd rather not think that I can't be you. I promise I'll shape up my gym so that you may challenge us again. I hope you'll be looking forward to that occasion as much as me. Registered gym in the rock center my booking now, apparently. So yeah, there's gonna be a guy here needs me like the lighthouse reaches dozens, blah 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 blah. That's a lighthouse. But look at how big I am compared to it. Actually, that's a pretty big lighthouse. Um, okay, so what we need to do is deliver that letter that we have to some guy inside the shipyard. And I'm gonna be honest. I was freaking confused the first time I went in here, but the guy you are, you can search this place if you want. You really don't get any items out of this. I think you get one out of the garbage cans when we're up here. Um, it's empty. It's empty. I think, I don't think you get one here. Yeah. Okay, so you go and you talk to this guy. Um, if there goes that, goes over, um, um, if this goes here and that goes over there, then where does this thing go and what about that doohickey? Ugh, I can't make heads or tails of this. Hi, I'm Doc. Captain Stern's commissioned me to design a ferry. Oh, that there. Are there Devon goods? But, hmm, this won't do. Captain Stern went off somewhere. He said he had some work to do. Could I get you to go find Captain Stern and deliver this to him? Okay. So I didn't show this off when I probably should have. But there was a line of people in here that were part of Team Aqua that you couldn't get into there. I should have shown that off before I went in there, but I didn't. And you gotta defeat them to go to the next gym because apparently you can't go to the next gym because of... These guys. So see you guys outside of the Pokemon Center. Okay. So you want to go inside this? The endless sustain of life. I don't know if you can hear the music at all, but um, yeah. I'm just using them entrance PS50, which is like the intro, yes, and all these Team Aqua members are pretty. But this is a remix of the SS and theme from the original game. Just listen, I'll be quiet for a second.
So yeah. I don't know if you guys have actually noticed that yet. So all these people are pretty... I'll probably come back here in a special episode about this, but they're all um, pretty useless. And you don't want to do what I just did. You actually want to walk over here for a second, and the very SS title. A scout epic of the ship under construction at the shipyard. But what will surprise you is the one that he's actually looking at is the SS Anne, replica of the luxury liner that circles the globe. Yes. Yes? If you're looking for Stern, that would be me. Ah! Those must be the parts I ordered from Mr. Stone of Devon. Thank you. That's great. We can prepare for our expedition now. And these two lackeys. I'll just take them on. And see you guys afterwards. I want to get something done this part. Okay, guys, so now if we don't get the pies, blah, 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 blah. So, does anyone know when Doug, when, um, Diglett evolves into a Doug Trio? If anyone could please put that in the comments below, I would appreciate that. And I'm sorry if my voice is extremely loud and it sounds like I'm talking too close to the mic this episode. I'm just trying to get used to the distance I can speak away from this mic, so, yeah. Okay, let's see what's taking you so long to get, snatch some parts, and you simple simps are held up by a mere child. We are Team Aqua, and we love the sea. And I am Team Aqua's leader, Archie. What makes you interfere with us? No! You can't be. You're not one of Team Magma. Wait, that can be, right? You're not dressed for the part. Pokemon people, all life depends on the sea. So Team Aqua is dedicated to the expansion of the sea. Don't you agree what we are doing is magnificent undertaking? Ah, oh, fine, you're still too young to understand. I know, full objective. But I'm warning you, don't even consider interfering with the plans again. The consequences will cost you dearly. And don't you forget it. And he's gonna... You're okay. Ah, oh, you're... Yuki! Anyway, that was a tense situation. Thank you for saving us. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot that you even brought the parts from... That you even brought the parts from Devin. Hands over to... Yuki handed over to Devin Good. Whoops, there's no time to lose. We have to set on our ocean floor expedition really, really soon. Thanks again, but I've got to go. Feel free. Wander around and check out facilities, though. And he heals your Pokemon. That's nice of him. Um, yeah. I, uh... What are you doing? I, yeah! Uh, what are you doing here? Me? I'm the team alpha member you stumped before, remember? Back in, um, Rust Turf Tunnel? Here, take this. You have to forgive me. Paying the TM46. I think TM46 is actually a useful TM. Not quite sure if it actually is a useful TM, but let's figure out if it is, guys. Is it berries? Oh, skill wing. If well, if me and my Pokemon could actually learn it, I'd teach it to me because it's a freaking amazing move. But yeah. Huh? I'm sure I met you somewhere before. Have I introduced myself to you? If not, my name's Scott. I just saw Team Aqua run away from here like they were stung. Let me guess. You drove them away? Hmm. Maybe. Just maybe. This trainer. Alright. I think you're going to become a good friend. So let's register each other in the Poke- in our Pokenams. Yeah, Pokenams. What I'd like to do is tag all, all of you, but I do want to keep an eye on the talents of other people, too. So I'll be off to roam other towns a bit more. But i uh, be seeing you, Yuki. Yeah, 
yeah, here's a place where you can buy a bunch of stuff. I might have to cut this part a little short. Shorter than 18 minutes like the last part because I got hiccups and I don't want to have hiccups during this video and I know we got nothing done. But, but, let's look through here and see if, well, let's see if first I have any Pokeballs. I'll be right back in this tall grass once I have Pokeballs. Okay, so let's see what Pokemon I can catch right here. I don't want to real leap. I'm not keeping really any of the rules. As long as I don't kill the Pokemon that I see, I can keep searching here. Until I kill one, I can't catch other ones here. Not my net trick. Yeah. Why is there, why am I finding all these shit Pokemon? Actually, if I'm turning up any really good Pokemon, let me know. I already have it done sparse. My team doesn't work. Let's try it. No, catch it. No, I can't catch Pokemon I'm right here. See you guys next part. Yeah, see you guys next part.